Hi YouTube, this is my first video of the AA Button by Button Tutorials and I'm gonna show you how you make this to look like this. Pretty cool, huh? Okay, let's get into After Effects. Hello guys, here we are in After Effects and here I am with a cowboy hat and a revolver so now I'm teaching you how you make professional looking muscle flash. Sorry guys, this is I'm making with Axe and Essentials 2 plugin. But you guys with no action essentials, I will make a video here soon where I use my own images, smoke and every other stock footage. But I went in the cheat chat. Now we'll get going. So here I have one, two, three, four shots. So I have here three action essentials shots so I will drag all of them actually here or in our project take here we have our first one we go from the mode to add we will find there was the first shot Bayam Put that there, make it be a little bit longer, so it matches the size of the gun. There comes the second, so we take our second. Okay, so we have here four shots. They all look very cool. So now, now it looks like professional looking muscle flashes. But that's not it. Now we take our Anders muscle flash layer, hold shift and go to the top to select all. We take Ctrl Shift C to pre compose. You can too go with a layer and pre-compose and we call this MF for muscle flashes then you will notice this will become black here in the background of all the layers so we go from mode back to add it's not a bigger deal bam 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 cowboy shot okay next we'll put some effects on the character which will be me for every shot though would be some light which will be reflecting on me so I find the first muscle flash here now we take our main comp control D to duplicate and put the nor of the mode to add this will make the all layer add then I go with G or just click on the pen tool I will mask now really fast around me like this now I'm all white but that doesn't look so good so we hit leather F for feather and we feather it out and take away that feather and click T for opacity and take that down then we simply make this this one frame long bueno okay now I will add this effect to all the shots Now we have lights which will be reflecting our shots. We're soon ready. There's one thing I want to help you guys with. In theory, this is kind of it. So I will now select all the comps and no, I take just where we have our add lights, 
shift and precompose them to light up like this. So now we have our shots, so we we will have this well like this to add bam 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 bam. Okay, in theory we are now ready. But there's one thing I want to do to match up the drama in this scene, and that's color correcting. So take a new adjustment layer. I could use the Magic Bullet Mojo because I can show you it's a really nice plugin from the Red Giant because that gives a really nice color. But because everyone does of you doesn't have it, so. I will make a video there where I'm making this my own muscle flashes. So there I am going to use uh, my homemade uh, color correction. If you are one of these guys who doesn't know how to do it, so stay tuned. In a few days it will come out. Okay, so now we have this. So we go one more time to uh, effects and presets and type Vignet. Sorry, Vignette, so misfire Vignette and throw it here up so we get this black Vignette here so we can take the intensity down a bit. So what we have here we go back to full, let's say to fit up to 100%. If you want to see hold your clip in full screen so go here you can see in preview you go for you check the full screen and then type just full screen. Now we see when it's rendering, and soon it will become with audio, and that's awesome. Thanks for watching this tutorial video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're really interested for some more VFX tutorials and my obvious uh, own videos of VFX and action and all, all this kind of stuff. Thanks for watching this video. Bye.